Yo, what's going on? Sexy Seven Lenders got it over here doing a ranked 1v1. I am playing Rom. Because he um He's my next up in diamond. Oh no, I just fought this guy and I deleted the video. The reason I deleted the video, it's not because he's toxic or anything, it's because he's in bronze one with 700 MMR. Um and I felt really bad about beating him. I picked the Wheelix, he was Scylla, and I kind of fucked him up. And I feel bad about it, but maybe because of the matchup disparity, he'll beat my ass this game and I'll lose 900 MMO. One can hope, right? You never can know. You never know. Did he do his buff? His gold isn't going up. Where is he? Ah, there's the buff finished. Okay. I guess he got there a little bit late. I'm gonna go do my blue buff. Mage's blessing. He wants that cooldown, huh? He wants that cooldown, huh? Do, 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 do. So the reason I'm playing Rom is because he has the most satisfying auto attacks out of any character in the game, I feel like. Um, they're not the best auto attacks, right? Like, they're not the strongest. Don't hit me. Um, but they are the most satisfying, and I don't think anyone's going to deny that. Oh god. Nice. Nice. We got him with the snipes, boys. I hit all three snipes. He aged the first one and got clapped by the second and third. It was a good ass Aegis, though, to be honest. I didn't think he got Aegis. Most Hades I know always go Shell or Thorns first item. So that they can be tankier when they ult. The Aegis caught me off guard. It almost it almost let him live. If I rapid succession my ult. Like pew pew pew. He actually would have lived and I would have felt real stupid. Oh gosh. Okay, he's actually fragging me. Oh. Okay, dude, this guy's bringing the heat on the on the Hades. I'm about it. Reason I max my one, by the way, is because it gives you a lot of bonus damage now. Nice. I'm actually Pupunana, dude. I'm Pupunana. I missed three autos in a row and somebody walking straight because they thought they were gonna juke. I'm actually Pupunana. So here's the thing, right? A lot of people think that if you hit all your abilities, you're a god, right? Or if you miss all your abilities, you're shit. <clears throat> but that's not entirely true, and let me let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. Because even people like Paul, who are mechanically probably one of the best in the game, Paul and Face and them, mechanically probably some of the best in the game. Um, hold on, I don't want to die. They still miss their abilities, right? Like, in a game like Smite, where it's always third person, right? It never, there's nothing auto-aimed other than like a Neath alt or a new Alt or whatever the fuck, you know? 
You're not auto aiming anything. Um, you're going to get situations where you just miss. Right? No matter how good you are, you're just going to miss because you can't predict the other person's juke pattern. Until, unless you play them a whole bunch, you know? Um, but when you play somebody a whole bunch, and you do get that juke pattern down, you can hit everything. But, that's not, that doesn't happen in ranked. Like, unless you're a pro player and you scrim these teams, it doesn't happen. You're not going to fight the same people over and over and over and over again. Um... Unless you play duel, I guess. So when you miss, you shouldn't feel bad about it, right? You should just be like, okay, well... Be like, that's his juke pattern. That's that's what I have to look out for from now on. Is... That kind of juke. And on the flip side, if you miss everything... You need to... Or, sorry, if you hit everything... Then... Um, just know that... You know, those couple missed abilities during the game aren't going to fucking matter. Like, it doesn't... Everybody's going to miss stuff. You can't expect the jungler to gank your lane and hit every ability every time. You can't expect your mid laner to just land three-man snipes every time. Ah, uh, I guess you get my red buff. Ooh. Does he get full health? I can kill him, right? God, he just... God damn it. God damn it. I was trying to wait out the Aegis originally, and, uh... <clears throat> I didn't. It was a good play to wait for the third shot rather than to try to Aegis the first. I think you die here. Nice. And the surrender. Alright. I kind of want to play ROM again, so I think I'll just double feature this. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to stay tuned. And like and comment and subscribe, but I'm not ending the video here, so stay tuned. Yo, what's up, Sexy Simulator Squad? We got the second ROM game coming at you. In case you're wondering, I'm relatively close to Diamond ROM. I have 919 worshippers. Um, <clears throat> also, I guess I don't say this on, on YouTube much, as I do on... Twitch, I'm not gonna go, hold on, I'm not gonna go a starter item in this game. Um, but I actually have almost 60 diamonds now. 60! I have 58 diamonds. Um, it's kind of a lot. And by kind of, I mean, it's like, it's really a lot. It's a lot of diamonds. I play the game a lot. I think I got four or five over my one week break. And it wasn't even double worshipper. I was just playing with my fiance, and we just grind the diamonds in casuals. Um, but yeah, but yeah, I have a lot of diamond gods. But I'm always looking for more, you know. Always grinding out the closest because you want to know why? Because. It's what really gets you better at the game. When you fully understand a god to the point you have them diamond, you know their ins and outs, it really does help your gameplay in a level where you wouldn't expect it to, I guess. Uh, ah, that wasn't worth it. Auto attack for a tower shot. Uh, uh, two autos, three autos. Four autos. His name is Kellogg's. Well, kind of. It's an eye, but it should have been Kellogg's. Oh my god, I just missed my slow auto like a fucking idiot. I am kind of fucking this guy up, though. 
gonna freaking him up. Let's get these many boys. I don't think you win this, Chief. Come on, get your butts in here. Fly, baby, fly. You don't need vision. Hmm. If they only had more catch up mechanics. <laughs> Dude, this man wants to ult the fuck out of me. This man wants to ruin my whole fucking career, bro. Or just ult my wave, I guess. Alright, 43 HP and no mana. Imagine if I let that guy kill me too. Imagine if he ulted me and my wave at the same time. He is Aegis. Did he Aegis house fight? Let me try to remember. I was autoing, autoing. He was sending his heal. He won. He tooed. He tooed and ran away while Aegis, and I turned to not get blinded. Yes, he did Aegis. Thank you, brain. You're the realist. All right. Fucking rude, to be honest with you. Alright, am I marbles? Oh, 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 oh. oh, my man's on that juke game, but not hard enough, brother. Not hard enough to get rid of the diamond rom snipes. I mean, I'm not Diamond yet, and my rank is technically higher than Diamond, so I guess calling myself the Diamond Rom doesn't make any sense at all, no matter how you look at it. <laughs> but that's okay. It doesn't need to make sense because it felt good to say, you know? Like, wow, I'm attractive. It doesn't have to be true as long as it feels good to say. Getting some buffs, getting some stackies going, you know? I needed to get a Toxic Blade this game for sure. Ooh, 85 damage. I went up quite a bit. Oh, there's a minion right there. What do you mean? Ooh, I'm coming. Did I try to kill him here? Oh. Okay. Never mind. Why did I get Shell, by the way, instead of, like, Bracer? I guess because I'm going Devos, I assumed he was going to go Anti-Heal, which is why I didn't get Bracer, but Shell? Like, I could have just got Cursed Onk or, like, Aegis or... I mean, I guess Shell's not bad. It's still technically a defensive relic. I just feel like there's better options that I didn't think about in the moment. Almost rolled into that one. What's up, daddy? Boom! I missed. A buff is up, though. Damn, I got 41 stackies. I'm gonna kill you, dude. You literally do not scare me. Okay, well, I mean, if you juke like that, then maybe you do. Oh! He actually almost killed me. I think that snipe actually would have hit me. And the surrender again. Two surrenders. Two surrenders? God, I'm just sick with the ROM, bro. I'm just sick with the ROM. 
Let's get a third game going then. Fuck it. Is my camera weird, by the way? Why does that look weird? Why do I look like I'm... My... Thing weird. What? What the fuck? I don't know. See you later. <clears throat> Welcome back, boys and girls. To the ROM Gamer Gaming Gamerly. There you go, Devos. This is gonna go late game, so let's just do this. Uh, this actually isn't that bad of a matchup. Let me tell you why. Because you might not believe me. It's actually not that bad of a matchup because of the fact that when he alts, I can alt and then wait out his three. So that he doesn't actually get that many things to kill me with. That being said, it's also not good at all. Um, it's not a bad matchup, but it's not a good matchup. Because he has a lot more poke than I do. But we'll make it work. <clears throat> we'll make it work. We'll make it work. I'll be okay. He's probably going to double buff. His clear is really fast, so... Would not surprise me. Yeah, he is double buffing. Alright. Oh, he wants to kill me. Jeepers Creepers. Hmm. He has five off this wave, by the way. Yep. Well, I don't like how much he poked me out. I also don't like not being level five. When he is, but uh, I'll get over it, I guess. Basically, I just didn't show my face so that he didn't try to kill me. Because he definitely could have killed me. I have to play the early game really safe until I have enough damage to actually hurt him. <clears throat> Your middle tower is under attack. Did hit level 5. Got this already. There's nothing up that I can get. Got red buff and definitely wants to make me not alive. However, it seems he's patient about not making me want to be alive. I have to let him get really far ahead, pretty much. I don't think I can just fight him off. <clears throat> I can't get my boots now. He got his boots. Going attack speed boots is definitely not the play. bunch of damage to me. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Nice. Grab this. Um, I could upgrade my shell, but I don't think I can set myself that far behind right now. I need to just keep trying to 
like I need to just try to keep up in XP. One transcendence. Probably gonna be able to steal this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That really sucks. I think the only way to win this game is to get the level 20 full build. Because early game, like, it's... It's absolutely a joke. Damn it, dude. Okay, I don't know about this, dude. He knows to just go straight for fire and... Yada yada. He knows I can't fight him until level 20 and he's abusing that. I don't know if I actually have a chance this game. Out of my way. Gonna have to give him my tower. Got transcendence now. Got devos, but I don't think that really matters. Just have to let him get it. I can't do anything about it. Hmm. I guess that's the thing, right? If he never fights me, then it doesn't matter what happens. It doesn't matter if I get to late game. Because <clears throat> he can win by just literally never fighting me. That, that, there's no way that hit me. Okay. There is no way that hit me. I'm going to go with Javal. He's probably just going to go defense here. He wants to push his lead as much as possible, and that's the smartest thing to do. If he doesn't go defense, then he is trolling. Yep. Yep, yep. Second Relic is horrific. <clears throat> hmm. He's two levels out of me now. Probably closer to three, to be completely honest. Oh, poop. One of that. I wonder if he's just waiting at Bull Demon. No, oh, no, he's not. You have to clear this wave, actually. Probably gonna do Bull Demon now. I'm in no position to stop him. <clears throat> <coughs> or to even attempt to stop him. My throat, sorry. <clears> throat> should be showing up on our radar soon. I need 1800 gold in order to get it, Chaval.
Oh, I actually got it, dude. I actually got it. That's so big. Holy shit, that's so big. Oh my god. That's actually fucking massive, dude. Now I just have to do that like two more times in order to get full build. <clears throat> just gotta get it two more times in order to get full build. See, I just used my ult to snipe him, so if he just like all ends me with ult. He can kill me super easy. Looks like he's not thinking about it though. My next item could be defense, but I think it honestly has to be like a toxic blade. It could be a toxic blade. I could go Toxic Silver Branch. It would give me a lot of power. But he's like, he's not healing other than in his alt. So I don't think I need the Toxic Blade. Could just go Aussie, double lifesteal would be nice, but he's going toxic play right now, so I don't know about that. Mm. Mm. I really think I just want to go straight into Silver Branch. When I use my two, my attack speed is high, dude. Like, I get a lot of power from it. I have no defense, though, man. That scares me. My defensive item could be a Midguardian. Obviously, Midguardian won't slow him, because... He's slow immune in his three, but um, it will slow his attack speed. Do I care about that? I mean, I doubt. I don't think I care about that. To be full demon is spawning. And get my silver branch. He started it. Okay, so <clears throat> now we have to fight. Now we have to fight, and I don't have alt. This is really not good. He actually got a witch blade, huh? actually got a witch blade i think i have to give him my phoenix without alt i can't fight him without alt i can't fight him your middle phoenix is under attack I think she has a decent amount of HP because of that Witchblade pickup. 
I guess I will go Kins. Do I upgrade something? Not bridge shell. It might come in handy, you never know. You never know. Well, at least we got one thing going for us, and that's the fact that we don't have to waste our alt on bull demon anymore. Which is nice. I'm just waiting for minions to push. I don't even have my hands on the keyboard. I'm literally just waiting for minions to push. Oboe would be nice for clear, to be completely honest. But... Didn't do that much damage to Titan. Didn't do that much damage. Don't think red buff is up. The red buff is not up. I did have to use my thingamabob. My shell, 1500 damage I guess, it kind of blows, but okay. Phoenix is almost respawned too, so. With Kins, I will do a significant more amount of damage since he does have 2200 HP. He's probably just doing Bull Demon again, by the way, but I don't I give a fuck. To be honest with you. As expected. Interesting choice. As expected. Rated is a bad idea, by the way. That's a bad item for him. I don't think he got that. Oh, my ult didn't go off in time. Damn. I should have ulted right when he ulted, I guess. That's my mistake. I feel like I played that fight really... I feel like I played that entire game perfect, to be honest. I gave up my objectives when I had to. <clears throat> I stole a bull demon. I waited for the late game fight, and then my one mistake not ulting early enough, it cost me the game. Is what it is. I mean, it's a terrible, terrible matchup, right? It's not a terrible matchup. It's it's a 50-50 matchup, but like it's it's in Set's favor because of the fact that I need so much in order to fight him. And all he has to do is PvE in order to win. So, it's his, it's, it's his favorable matchup in that regard, but in like a, like an actual fighting mechanics, it's even. But, in duel when you can just PvE, it is definitely in favor, I guess. Which sucks. But that's okay. I hate to end on a loss, but I'm going to, because I've been recording for an hour and a half. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and until next time, guys, peace.